After celebrating number four on October 4th, St. Louis and Cardinal Nation now focusing on number five and slugger Albert Pujols. Fox 2's Angela Huddy is live at our Spark St. Louis Bureau at Bar Park, Ball Park Village with a continued celebration of our future Hall of Famers. Angela. Mandy, back-to-back -back days of tributes for these beloved Cardinals who are going to be hanging up the caps after this season. October the 5th, number 5, it's Albert Pujols Day. And fans say you could not have written just how well this season has gone for the one known as the machine. On Sunday, St. Louis Mayor Tashara Jones declared Wednesday, October 5th, is Albert Pujols Day in the city of St. Louis. The proclamation called him a man of faith and noted his passion, dedication, sportsmanship, and love for the game. Fans have taken notice of that joy on and off the field. Drivers have noticed this tribute along eastbound Interstate 44. The home run count has been anonymously maintained by a fan of number five. I think since Dan Musial, I think he was a guy who really brought the region together as far as a baseball club. Winning is what Jim Schutzenhofer says Albert came home to do. Rather than selling t-shirts, I think the guy was sincere about helping the club win games. Friend Tom Kilduff is a St. Louis transplant, growing up a Yankees fan, but he has embraced the Cardinals. I got to see Albert's first 11 years here, and it's like nothing that's ever happened in baseball before. He was upset when Albert headed for California, but says he understood the decision. When he came back, I don't think anybody expected what happened this year. You couldn't. It's crazy. Longtime fan Betty Lerman was thrilled by Albert's chase to 700 home runs and beyond. She says she'll miss him on the field next year. Represented our city really well, and, and he made an impression with all the play other players. They all loved him. And I know we all hope that we're cheering on Albert Pujols, Yadier Molina, and all of the Cardinals through a very, very long postseason run. We kick things off with the NL wild card against the Phillies Friday at 107. Reporting live from our Spark St. Louis Bureau at Ballpark Village, I'm Angela Huddy, Fox 2 News.